Good morning, everybody. It is Saturday morning. Uh, I'm not real sure what the hell the time it is. But anyway, uh, you can tell the, uh, the alfalfa, the second cutting is coming back with a bandit. So what I'm doing today is these bales have been sitting on the ground long enough that if I don't get them off today, all the alfalfa underneath is going to be dead. So that's what we're doing here. Since I last talked to you, uh, after I've gotten that other field, the field on our new farm raked, since then, I want to say that was three days ago, maybe four, three, whatever. Uh, yeah, that this all this ground's had an inch 40 of, of rain on it. So yeah, if I don't get this off, I hate driving around and, and driving on it. But what I'm doing is, uh, I'm making long or, or wide turns. And if I make wide turns, I don't tear up the, uh, the alfalfa. This is new alfalfa, it's not really real great yet. So uh, I just make a big, big wide turn and hope for the best. If I don't get it done, it's just going to keep growing and my alfalfa is going to be, you know, toast under there and I'm not cutting around bales. I've never cut around a bale yet and I'm not going to start now. So anyway, that's what I'm doing. Sorry folks, trying to do this with uh, just two hands and it's, uh, it's not hard work, it's not difficult by any stretch, but you need, you know, you need both limbs. Unless you're a harmless farmer, and then you're a stud, you know, what a guy. Uh, anyway, I hope everybody had a great fourth. Uh, I actually didn't do a heck of a lot. The uh, wife went camping, is custom, you know, she was on vacation all week, so I haven't seen her much. Uh, later today, we're going to try and, I don't know, see once what the heck we're going to do with that, that uh, alfalfa land over there in that big thick window. I know what I'd like to do, but I don't have a, uh, oh, what do they call them here? Uh, I, can't, I can't think of it. Not a tether. It just picks a fluffer. It just picks the hay up with, on a belt, tips it over, and puts it on the other side in a nice... I don't have one, and I don't know where to get one. To be perfectly honest with you, I'm about as poor as uh, two church mice. Not one. But anyway, that's what we're doing today here on uh, on the ranch. Is moving bales. Uh, I'm moving bales. Um, Devin's spraying right over here. He's spraying my forage coats, and he uh, he's spraying my. Um, my forage ryegrass, you know, it comes back at you know, it comes back every year. It's a grass. I planted it. If you look out into there, well, we'll get closer. But anyway, that he's using uh, a pint of wide match. Uh, it's a little expensive, but I tell you what, there won't be any weeds in there. The stuff just flat out kills stuff. Uh, for us, it's the best thing to use in. Um, in our hay crop like this. We try to sell hay, we don't want the weeds in it. So we sure as hell don't want the customer weeds in it. But anyway, this alfalfa is okay. Uh, it's not great, it's not super bad. Now that stuff over on the new farm, I expect that to be black. I just hope it dries off, I don't know. Uh, you guys leave me your comments on how to get it fluffed up with, with very little stuff like a rake. And uh, also tell me, if I should just take it off, because we got storms coming again. No, they're not even legal when they said that. But anyway, that's what's that's what we're doing these days. These days, last uh, last three days, I didn't do shit. Sat in the house, got caught up on a bunch of stuff, and fed a few kill cows we got, trying to get them out before we. Uh, Every week when there's a sale, by the time, excuse me for the freaking mirror, or excuse me, mirror, winch your wiper. Anyway, yeah, that's what we're going, what we got going. Um, later today, maybe I'll have a, a raking, or it's just going to be fun getting into that place. That place is, uh, you can get into it one way. 
and uh, there is a swamp there. I've had my pickup stuck in there once. Last time, the tractors were up to the uh, ladders. Anyway, that's Big John. He ain't even staring. He's using that uh, little brown box or that brown box John Deere has. He's really liking that sprayer. I'm glad. He, uh, he does a hell of a good job. He's a pretty good kid. I can call him a kid. Um, I'm two days older than uh, Dirk. You ever heard that before, have you? Anyway, everybody take care. Have a good, uh, it seems weird, but have a good Saturday and have a good weekend. Everybody be, be safe. And uh, maybe I'll have a raking video or a nightmare video from over in the new farm. Catch you guys later.